what's up guys and thank you for joining my youtube channel um today i'm going to show you my new dome home as you can see here's my dome home <clears throat> first i'm going to show you the outside then the inside all right so we have a little picnic area over here and you can literally just tell yourself to sit down and then you can grab tea or whatever. We have tea, donuts, um, apples, all kinds of stuff. Over here we have the playground. Um, we have a swing set. By the way, I made all this myself. You can literally sit down on the swing. Tell yourself to sit down on the swing. Right now I am not on the swing. But you can jump onto the swing. Tell yourself, sit down on the swing. It's kind of tricky the way I made it. Let's see if this works. We're pretty much on the swing. But yeah, earlier I was literally sitting on the swing. But right now, it doesn't want to do right. But yeah, eventually you will be able to just sit on the swing. You'll just have to keep jumping until you get into the right spot to sit down. At the right spot. This is my um monkey bars um you can literally just go over top of it because it won't go you can't go underneath like uh, actual monkey bars anyways yeah i can see that i messed up right here for some reason it didn't place right but that's okay this is my slide go up the ladder that I made and then tell yourself to sit down and you can literally slide down practically to the bottom and literally my pet just slid all the way down anyways over here is the pit table area so when I first thought about it, I'm like well you could just jump up there but they do have stairs which works so you can get over here and eat your lunch or a snack okay Moving along to the back side. Um, over here is some rocks. Why not? You can sit in your little throne. Um, which is cool. There you go. Pretend like you're the king or queen. A lot of my things are like imaginary and stuff. So you can... In this place that I made, you can be what you want to be, you know. Um, it can be realistic or unrealistic. Like right now we've got some ice flowers. These were the only flowers I saw that were not in a vase. So I used them. We have ice flowers. And then all around the back here is some more ice flowers. Because I want to do ice flowers. Because I can find any other flowers to do. In here is our little room. You can go sit down. And literally, there's a little table. So, you can eat something in there. It's like your little glass room. If you ever heard of glass room, I don't know if you have or not. But if you haven't, that's what that is. A little glass room. Um, you can enjoy a private meal to yourself. Anyways, we're going to go in the back door because front door is technically way on the other side. So, we're not going back around. There's nothing on that side of the house to see. Um, we're going to go in the back. Anyways, first we're going to go through here and start with the kitchen. This is my kitchen. Um, this is the fridge it came with. And then I tried to match it with the flooring and the walls. I have two water bowls, two food bowls for your pets. And some lights, some cool looking lights. To go over the pet stuff and then we have a stove a microwave um, some cabinets countertops a fan for your stove and then a bookshelf with some books that would be your cookbooks and all that and then a little trash can and that's pretty much everything in this room um hold on Oh yeah, there are some lights above. And then this is our dining room area. We don't have much seating. Um, because 
My whole theme in this whole thing was nature. So most things in this house, I was trying to do nature. So we have a bunch of like nature stuff. Um, so that's why I've got these flower tables. And um, above each table is also, you can see a light. And I made it look more like a restaurant, but that's what my thing was, was flower tables. I probably could have added another one, but I re really just like how it looks, which is the two. And these are leaf chairs, by the way. The whole thing is nature slash animals, that sort of thing. That's what I was trying to do. Anyways, here's the living room. You can sit on the couch. We have a leaf TV, which is cool. It's on right now, but you can turn it off. Turn it off? Turn it off. Here's our bookshelf with some more books to read, whatnot. Here's your fireplace. I added a flower some flowers on top just for decoration. I did add a piano because sometimes you need to play the piano for your task your playground task and sometimes pianos I just feel like make the house look good and um it makes it look nicer with the piano um the badger needs to sleep and drink and I can just cash tap so I'm gonna go up here for the sleeping um this is the bedroom so as you can see we got some storage area up for your clothes um dresser there and then a dresser underneath there there's a fridge here you can get water out so uh, but first i need to let my pet sleep in one of these beds um there's a pet bed up here this one's the pet bed that one's actually a crib those are the ones that came with the house with these beds right here these three and then I added some nature beds because nature house. So there's a baby pet bed over there too. That's a nature one. I think. If I'm not mistaken, one of them's the baby baby pet bed and one of them's the baby bed. I think this one's the baby bed. And I think that one's the baby pet bed. And then this is supposed to be your adult bed. So the adult can sleep in here too. It can sleep up to one adult. We have a crib up there for a baby, a pet bed there, another pet bed there, and I think that's a pet bed. I think one of them's pet bed, one's baby bed, and that's a baby bed, I think. <laughs> um, anyways, um, I think my pet is done sleeping. By the way, I just got this badger recently. It's the new badger in the fall update. Um, these glasses are my new donut glasses in the fall update. I'm hoping to get more, um, glasses. No, not glasses. More accessories. There we go. More pet accessories in the fall store. And let's go ahead and go to the bathroom because, yeah, my pet needs to shower. So I got two showers. I got the shower it came with and then I got this nature shower. I added a nice I'm trying to go with like white and black pretty much white and black countertops and stuff so I added white and black um, sink toilet there's a trash can because if you think about it most bathrooms have trash cans in them you know I should have added one in the bedroom but oh well then we got a, a bathtub I did it green did it the green bathtub because nature and green is um, definitely a nature color. So, well, before I show you the last piece, I'm going to go back down because it needs to um, do the playground task. And for the playground task, you can just do the piano. So I'm gonna let it do that, and I'm gonna go up here while it's doing that and show you the last piece. So, by the way, like I said, my thing was to do nature and animals. So I got animal print and nature. And this bathroom, we have like a map pretty much um, for the flooring and then more trees for the wall. 
And then I added, like, green and this rug and added, like, the color green. So it's, like, green and blue. Which I feel like those are both nature colors. Um, this staircase is literally just so you can go up there to the other beds. And I thought it would be cool. Um, that way I can fit more beds in here. And then this little storage area down here, which I told you it was under there, but I don't know if I actually showed you. So, there's plenty of storage. This is my sandbox. I literally was trying my hardest to come up with a way to make a shovel and a bucket, but I could have looked up a video on how to do it, but I was like, you know what? I'm just going to put a bunch of bowls, bottles, and those sort of things. Because kids like to play with bowls, bottles, pans, that sort of thing in sandboxes. They don't always have to have a bucket, you know. But this right here was an attempt to make a bucket, but it didn't really turn out very great. I didn't look up any videos on how to make it. But you know what? That could be a little table. Honestly, it works more for like a little table. And then I got a little ring. So, you know, they can play with that. Um, people use rings as frisbees. Over here we have two seats. So the kids can sit down. Um, I did the um, stump seats because nature. Why not? And then I added a little bouncy area because kids like to bounce. And this is just something fun for the kids to do. I added a tent because kids like to play in tents and things. And they can hide in here. And yes, you can be a kid on here if you have never played. Switch the baby. See? Now I'm a baby. And this bowl is way too high up. Some of my items, when I placed them, or when I moved them, they were too um, high up. So I tried to lower them. Some of them didn't lower. Like, that's as low as that one's getting. I wanted the items to not be hidden. But I didn't want them to be way up in there, so I tried to lower the items. And some of them lowered like they should have. And then some of them did not. Now most of the items are at least close to the sand. And this is the sand area, by the way. That's what that is. My little sandbox. The sand's way up high, but... I didn't want to do the little bitty um, mounds of sand. So um, I just did medium and small mounds of sand. Um, but they did have other sand options, but I didn't want to do them. And that's that. Um, right now, they do have... Um, hold on. My pet needs to come back out. Right now, they do have a snow update going on. And if you are on Roblox and can pay me at any time, just comment on this YouTube video. Hey, I'm on Roblox. I can pay you. And then comment your username. And I will literally DM you and um, um, ask you if you can play Adopt Me. And if you will respond to that message um, when you get it. Um, just let me know if you can play. And if you can play Adopt Me, um, I will get the house out not this house because it does not have the cash first i'll get one of my house that does and then you can pay me i am literally saving up for a lot of items i'm saving up for a snowmobile um maybe both the snow plow and mobile whatever items um uh, i think i'm gonna eventually buy both of them hopefully i'm saving up for some fall items i do have three accounts but i can only get on two accounts because one of my, 
because one of my devices um, broke and I had to throw it away. So I can only use two of my accounts at one time. So I can only pay myself with one account technically. And I don't get a lot of money that way. So um, if you can get on and pay me at some point, that would be um, great. But yeah, just comment down below your username and I'll just DM you and um, we'll see where that goes. Anyways, I got a lot of tasks to do. Um, for my badger, before I can show you the snow update, I like to do my task first instead of waiting, um, just because it can eventually disappear, and I like to go ahead and get it done, and then do the things I want to do, you know what I mean? Um, there's so many stuff that I want to buy, and all that. But I can show you the winter store and everything as soon as I get done doing my task. Oh yeah. I forgot. I'm a baby right now, so I got tasks to do. Babies do have tasks to do. And it says, um... I need to eat, and then we need to go to the campground. If we have time to go to the campground, that is. The campground is one task that does not last long. It only lasts while it's nighttime, which nighttime is actually a short period of time on Adopt Me. But we're gonna try to go. I like to just teleport to places then I can just go out of the place I teleported to and literally just go from there. Um, sometimes I'll just click navigate to campground just so it's easier for it to tell me how to get there. Even though I already know how to get there, but it's just easier. I feel like if it just tells me <laughs> how to get there. Because it might know a faster shortcut than me with the errors. <laughs> Anyways, we're going to the campground, and we're camping. I just cut through there, which is the easier shortcut. Anyways, I gotta be at the campground, and when you click on your task, it can literally show you your percentage of how much longer you got to do the task. Um, once it reaches hundred percent. You're completed and you get your money. As you can see, I got 728 bucks, but the items that I want to purchase in the snow store are very expensive. I think they're like 3000 for the um, vehicles I want to purchase. So that's why I'm saying if you can pay me, just comment down below. I can pay you and comment your username. So that way I can add you too. Alright, we got some more tasks to do. But, um. Who? Badger is thirsty, so sometimes I'll just click feed and then give him a drink that I already have. That way I don't have to literally take him to a water bowl and stuff. Technically, we do need to wash up. So I'm going to see if this person's house is unlocked. I'll just go in people's houses and literally, um, nope, of course they're locked, but I like to go in people's houses. Let's hope this one's unlocked. I like to go in people's houses, that way I don't have to go to my house, because on this account my house is way in the neighborhood and the neighborhood is in outside of the town so it's a long walk and even driving is pretty long feels pretty long to me so I'm gonna just go through here because I've been through this house before actually I just remember that's the house I went to earlier today they just moved it anyways I'm gonna let the badger shower and me shower and then we're going to school and then hopefully the test 
will not come up anytime soon because I want to show y'all. Ooh, I just got 150 and then 80 bucks for doing tasks. By the way, this is my task board. As you can see, these are the tasks you have to do to get your money. I just completed two and got some money. But yeah, I don't think I'm going to get enough to get what I wanted, you know, from the snow store. But in time but um i'm definitely going to try to get some money anyways the school's over here um so if you're a baby or a pet and it says go to school you can literally just go to school and obviously i'm sick again with my pet which i was literally just sick a little while ago so it really hasn't been that long. Kind of makes me mad. I keep getting sick and tasks and all kinds of stuff keep popping up. But we'll just see how long it takes to get done with this. Oh, and you can write stuff on the board at school. And yeah, I hate scammers too. <laughs> There's people on here that do scam you. So if you do play. Um, just watch it. When you trade with people, they can scam you. You have to go get your trading license, though, to trade legendary items. And the trading license place is in the town. But, yeah, if you're not already playing Adopt Me, I do recommend it. It is fun. I've gotten one person that downloaded it. Um... Maybe more than one. What am I doing? I don't need to go in their house. I need to go to the hospital. <laughs> Sometimes I'll get distracted. Anyways. Um, but yeah. If you don't really ha already have Roblox. I would download Roblox. And then in your search bar. Um, you can literally search Adopt Me and play. Click join. Um, if you want to add me. On my account's. I have three accounts. So as I'm going to the snow store, let me just explain my accounts. First of all, um, this account that I'm on right now is Santa Baby 512. I repeat, Santa Baby 512. S A N T A B A B Y 512. Two Santa Baby by one two. Now, I do have another account. I have two more accounts. The next account is Sunflower Sarah two. Now these are not my um, first accounts. These are the last two that I created. So the like I said, it's Sunflower Sarah. Two. I think some blurs. <laughs> Y'all, I'm getting confused now. What did I say the first time? Sarah, some, sunflower, Sarah two. Yeah, that's what it is. Sunflower, Sarah two. S U N F L O W E R, Sarah S H. I uh, sorry. S A R A H two. Sunflower, Sarah two. My um name ends in an H. So Sunflower Sarah too. Um we're in the store now. Um, yeah, there's no point going down there. It's just water and a bridge. I went down there before to see. Um my next uh, uh account, which is my first account I ever made, is Sarah. And Ham 1997. Sarah and Ham 1997. S A R A H A N N H A M 1997. So 1997. Sarah and Ham 1997. So my three accounts are Santa Baby 512. If you need to go back in the video to remember what they are, do it. Santa Baby 512. Sunflower Sarah 2 and then first account ever 
there in ham 1997 you can add all three accounts you can add one of them um, it may not let you add them I don't know some of my accounts are full uh, my first account ever I think is completely full so I don't think you can friend me because you can try but I don't think it'll work because there's a limit on how many friends you can have on this account which stinks but yeah, if you really do want to friend me and it won't let you, just comment that down below. Hey, it won't let me friend you, but I want to be your friend. And then I'll get rid of a friend that I don't care about and I'll add you. Anyways, let's look at the store because it's been a while since I've been in here. We got a snowflake badge. Okay. These are for your pets. We have some snowflake earrings, which I think I already had those. On my other account. What? Oh, some snowflake throwing disc. Uh, sorry, it won't let me show you a better view of it. But obviously, you can see it up top. Oops, cold me. Um, ice lolly. I already got some of those ice lolly. I can show you right here. There's my ice lolly. It's an ice lolly pop. Um go to this real quick so you can get an albatross or a ribbon seal with the ribbon seal looks cool but I don't want it albatross looks better uh, I would probably take the albatross but the albatross cost robux which is 240 I don't really want the seal I got a cute little badger from the fall store that I really like but I don't really like the seal. <laughs> Technically, I got some other pets that are better. <laughs> um, here's some snow goggles for your pet. It's cute. Snow cloud. I don't know if I ever bought that. I wanted it. Yeah, I did. Here it is. What is it? Oh, here it is. See, it's so cool. It's like snow coming down. I'm going to keep that out. Um, ice grapple. Okay. I'm not trying to buy it. Okay, it's 5000 for the ice grapple. Insane prices on some of these items. Like, an ice grapple should not cost 5000 But whatever. Snowmobile is right here. Now, this is not the snowmobile I wanted to buy. Nah, that is the actual snowmobile. But that's not what I want to buy. This is a violin. It looks cool, but no. This is a snowman plushie, which I'm pretty sure I already bought that. This is a cozy snow scarf. It's super duper cute. And then this is the pogo stick. A ski pogo stick. Um... I think I did buy that plushie. Why am I not seeing it? Y'all, I don't see my plushie. I'm up. Ooh. I think I did buy it on the other account. That's what it is, I think. I bought it, I think. I remember buying it. I must have bought it on the other account. Anyways. Get rid of that balloon because it's not doing right. Anyways, let's go up here. Um, these are the vehicles I want. This is actually a Tundra Exploration Machine. And then the Snowplow. These are the ones I was talking about, not Snowmobile. I call that one right here a Snowmobile because I didn't remember what it was called. But it's a Tundra Exploration Machine. So this is the snow store and that's all they really have for the snow thing. I mean, you can run around the ice outside but that's about it anyways thank you once again for watching this video um thank you for joining me and i hope that you will add me if you have roblox and if you don't have roblox i would recommend you download it and i would love to play with you on roblox um we don't have to play about me i also play um Bloxburg that is on my other account 
that is um, the two main games that I play. I have played Fashion Famous before. I like that one. Um, there was another one I did play once. And then I used to play... Um, uh, I can't remember what it's called. Safe Haven? Something like that. I don't know. Y'all know more than me. Anyways, um, these are the, this is the main game I play, which is Adopt Me. I have played the other one. Before you play Adopt Me, there's the other game that's called Meep City. I have played that, but overall, I like this one better. So, anyways, thank you for watching, and um, hope you get, I hope you get, I hope you get Roblox if you don't already have it. And please add me, comment your username in the comments. Thank you. And if you can't add me, let me know. Thank you so much.